feeling really good today. Summer, got my summer shorts on. I finally squashed the beef with Method Man. Hey guys, Johnny Nerd out here. Got another custom e-bike build for you. And I uh, want to go over what this bike is, why I personally like this bike, and what I think is really cool about this bike. If you're new to this channel, I'm Johnny Nerd out. I convert bikes into e-bikes and getting more butts on bike seats and out of car driver seats. It's the future. You can't deny it. Okay. This is a Marin Rock Springs 2. This is a this is a nice bike. It's a nice hardtail mountain bike. It's got rock shocks, front suspension fork. These are 27 and a half by 2.3 inch tires. So they're they're a nice, you can even go a little bit fatter with these. But these are a nice middle ground of fat enough that it's got a lot of traction, skinny enough that it's still super agile. So this would be a great trail trail bike. This would be great for just ripping up trails or put a rear rack on it. Great commuter bike, that's why I love hardtails. And check out this inside triangle. Plenty of room for a big battery here. This is a 52 volt, 17 and a half amp hour battery. Paired with a BBS HD, let me get that off of there. Protective film, we don't need you anymore. BBS HD, 1000 watt. Puts out about 1700 watts at peak. Got a 46 tooth stock chain ring on this one. Gear shift sensor. Display, we went with the SW102, which is a plain black and white display. It's essentially the 500C with just black and white, with slightly less information on it. It's got hydraulic disc brakes on it, so this thing stops confidently. This is a really good, ideal bike right here, guys. For, I would recommend this bike to probably 80% of people. If you're looking into getting into a bike and you're like, I don't know where to go, this bike, this style bike with these quality components. All right, let's go check out Johnny Nerdout test. Yeah, you can see even with the stock chain ring 46 tooth, this thing climbed crazy because of, you can see this giant low gear back here. It's pretty big. I'd say this is Probably a 40 tooth back here. So you're getting almost a one to one gear ratio, which means this thing is gonna just climb like crazy. You could go smaller. That's a great thing about mid drives. You switch out this front chain ring and it changes the whole dynamics of this bike. You could put a 28 tooth on here and this thing will climb anything. Like literally, as long as you could hang onto the bike, this thing will climb it. Personally, I like 36 to 42 tooths, but if you just wanna save money and go with the stock chain ring, you know, this is a fine chain ring. All right. Thanks guys, I want to say thanks again to Method Man for squashing our beef and we're able to go about our peaceful ways. See you guys.